Welcome to our lesson on converting between metric units. So we're going to begin by converting between centimetres and metres, which we can do using this conversion factor here. And we can write this as a ratio. So 100 centimetres is the same as one metre. And to convert 200 centimetres, we multiply the 100 by two, We'll do the same to the meters and one times two is two so 200 centimeters is two meters and we can convert nine meters into centimeters by multiplying the one by nine and we do a hundred times nine and we get 900 so 900 centimeters is the same as nine meters do you want to try and work out the missing four values here? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So here we have 1.5 metres, 11.5, 600 centimetres and 450 centimetres. OK, let's move on to two more questions. So now we're going to convert between millilitres and litres which we can do using this conversion, which again, we can write as a ratio between millilitres to litres. And we know 1000 millilitres is the same as one litre. So 2000 millilitres will multiply both sides by two. So we have two litres. And for three litres, We'll multiply both sides by three, so we have 3,000 millilitres. Again, do you want to try and work out the next four values? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So here we have 3.6 litres, 5.54, 4,200 millilitres and 900. Now do you want to try and convert between the grams and the kilograms by identifying the correct conversion? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So we're going to use this conversion, which we can write as the ratio between grams and kilograms. And we have a thousand to one. So 7,000 grams will be the same as seven kilograms and four kilograms will be the same as 4,000 grams. And the remaining answers are eight, 1.2 kilograms, 6,200 grams, and 7,500. Okay, thank you for watching, and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again, and take care.